Where is he? Where is he? Oh, my old mate. Hey! Come on, mate, jump in. How are we? Yeah, hang on, don't move the muscle. Oh, okay, okay. Look at this, this is service, boys. Sit in, mate, sit in. Jump in. Oh, even a coffee as well. Almond latte, half week. <laughs> Sugar. There you go, mate. Sugar? No, no, no. Nah, <laughs> equal, one equal. club decided that they'd go in a different direction and one of the guys who I grew up with playing, and we started this together, played 200 plus first grade games with, yep. to, they decided to, to move on from him uh, and bring someone else in with, with him, which was Cooper. Um, really tough because I'm, I'm a loyal dude and he's mm. junior was, was, you know, we came Sorry, through together, played schoolboy yeah. footy together, we won a comp together and it's hard to see one of your, your really good mates, you know, told to move on. Yeah. Uh, not it wasn't that harsh. Like the the club offered him to stay. Yeah, that's uh, right. Yeah, they yeah. weren't. Uh, but, but knowing you know, for him, you know, we know Pizzi very for him, well. Mate, he he needs, wants to run, wants the, team. To run a team, yeah. right? And that's I fully understand that. I fully yeah, understood totally. where the, the club was. We had a chance to get yep. a pretty good halfback in in Coops. <laughs> um, so it was a bit of a felt like another fresh start. You know, yep. there was a, a lot of motion went into that. And one thing I do remember about Coops is that that uh, preseason. He rang each uh, person in the leadership group, um, and just let, to let you know, like I'd never spoken to him before. Played yeah. against him a lot, and yeah, yeah. he said, "Hey, mate, I understand. You know what? Uh, how close you were to Piercy. I want to let you know that uh, I'm here to win a comp. I'm here to to go after something special with you guys, and I can't wait to train and rip in." And, and I thought that was so cool for a guy. He, mm. he didn't have to do that. He didn't have to call me or yep. any of the guys. And he actually called me as well. Oh, we, there you we, go. We, <laughs> we actually had coffee together. And yeah. We sat down and he he wanted to learn about the Roosters culture and the boys and the history before it. And he actually was reading the the uh, the book about the Roosters history as well. Yeah. So like he he dived into it, didn't he? He went head first. Yeah. And there's a connection there. I think he had some family that played like Roosters yes, first grade back true. in the day. You're right. Uh, they lived in the area, so it was nice to connect with that. It was yep. a big call from him too. Like he'd come from a really great setup where he was. Um, yep. And yeah, so anyway, he, he's he's in a training. We're all sort of getting used to having a new halfback, and and, and, you know, and in awe of a guy. And the, sort of the first quarter of the season, you were sort of ordinary. Yeah, ordinary. Yeah, 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 we got. I remember, I remember round one, we got done by the Tigers, right? Like yeah, was, yeah, that was. We got done close, by two but, points. Yeah. And, yeah. Wasn't the way he wanted to start, and the, and the media were out. I feel like were out for us. Um, but yeah, we know how long the NRL season is. I think um, you know, in at the Roosters, man, I would have won maybe one below five of my round one games ever. You That's know? true. Like, Me too. Just, yeah. For whatever reason, it's. Oh, I used to beat South back in the day. Yeah, easy, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> but that that was just the way. Like it, yeah. was, it felt like that. Our coaching staff and our trainers built us yes. for the 24, 25 yeah. round season, and you yep. had to trust in that. And yep. um, yeah, we knew we were going after something pretty cool with him in our side, in our team. We got better every week, um, and then we yeah sort of rolled into the back end of the year. Our, ta- our team was set, you know, we're, and we get to ourselves to another prelim, right? Yep. Yep. This time Media it's against talk. South. Yep. Massive. Media talk starts oh. to come. Last ever game at Allianz this Stadium. Game, this game, I remember, it was, yeah, again, you're right, last ever game at Allianz Stadium. I remember walking in, I was three hours before the game, and the tension yeah. in the air, the fans were already there. I, like, I've, my hair's standing up in the back of my head now, yeah. because I've never felt tension like it. Like, the best rivalry in the game, without yeah. doubt. Yeah. Last ever game at Allianz Stadium. The tension was unbelievable. Yeah. That was we had some close How games. How was it playing? Mate, it leading was, in, it was the week. Yeah. And for whatever reason, I you know earlier in the week, I never. No matter what game it is, I'm chilled out. And as the week goes on, yep. the intensity builds yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. But for this week, it was, yeah, it was there was something more. There's, you're walking down the street. There's mm. a lot of people are the Roosters or they're South yeah. fans. Yep. Everybody's talking about it. There's extra pressure on that. Oh. Like if you guys get knocked out again in a prelim, then yeah, yeah, that's right. It's a failure of a season. Yep. That that was my take on it, right? So, anyway, there. I think GI was still playing for, and they yeah, still had yeah. a stacked team from yeah, fourteen. Yeah. Big. Um, and but we we back ourselves no matter what, and we missed Latrell. He was he got suspended for a week. That's right, he did. So too. young Paul Morowski was playing in the centres. Big game um, for him. 
but I think I think I was named in the centres that week. Yep. So there was a little bit of ducks and drapes there, um, and went on to win. Paul scores a try to he seal the too. game, yeah. uh, and it was just such a tense. It was like eighteen. 10 or 18 6 or it was really tight yeah really really tight uh anyway coops gets tackled pretty hard in that game yeah, <laughs> yes yeah. breaks his shoulder um i don't even know until after the game yeah. the next morning recovery he walks yeah. in and everyone's still buzzing we're going to a grand final yeah how good's this yeah he walks in with a arm a, a brace oh, on yeah, yeah. and i've gone hey what have you done have you he goes mate I've, I've broken my shoulder i'm about to tell the boys that i'm not playing this week Mate, my heart sank. I was mm. like, oh, no, you're kidding me. Like, mm. We're about to really go after it. We're, yeah. we're playing Melbourne. Like, yeah, just, yeah, big, yeah. It was going to be huge, you know. Like, we'd just gotten through a really big week and, and we were ready to go. And he said he wasn't going to play. So um, the week, anyway, that week went on. It was a crazy week. Yep. For, I sort of got wrapped up in a little bit. Yeah, you know, you got named, named the halfback. halfback. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, all week, Robbo, he rang me on Tuesday did, did, night. Did you, did you actually train at halfback? Were yes. So the, whole, the, plan so was, the plan was you were going to play. Double bluff. I was going to play halfback. Yeah, you were. So he rang me on Tuesday night and said, mate, I'm going to, as before the team gets announced, I'm yeah. going to name you at halfback. And I'm going, oh. <laughs> and he goes, that's not even the worst part. You, I think you're going to play hard. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh. Oh. So, right. I said, okay, mate. He goes, come in the morning. I want to show you some clips. I want to show you exactly how it's going to work. Yep. We'll talk about that. Yep. Mate, I didn't sleep a wink, eh? Yeah, I was yeah. going. Yeah. A grand final's already pressure enough. That is big. Um, that is big. So, I was sitting there going, right, I'm about to play halfback in the grand final. Oh, man, what am I doing? If we get done, I'm going to be the laughing stock like... The team gets announced. My mates are even laughing at me, going, "You're not playing halfback." My mm. best mates from school, like. Mm. So I was like, "Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah made yeah, the seven. Yeah. Like, you got to go along with yeah, it and this yeah, sort of stuff." Yeah, yeah. And they're like, "Oh, surely you're not. No, you're not. Just not telling us." And it's all these sort of stuff. And I was yeah. like, "I actually am." Like, <laughs> in my back of my head. Anyway, yeah. Come Wednesday morning, I go and do the video, mate. I, I park it. I go, "Nah, well, if I'm going to do this, I'm going to rip it. I'm yeah. going to." Yeah, yeah. I, I, have a chat, I have a chat to Fitz. Fitz goes. Do you know the opportunity you have here? And I sort of like, oh yeah, to like win a grand final. He goes, no, no, to win a grand final, playing halfback, mate. It, mm. it could be one of the greatest stories, mm-hmm. you know, ever to to be written for yeah. yourself and the club. And yeah. mate, take that. I've just gone, oh cool, like that's mm. that is pretty cool. So like I said, from that moment, I'm pretty good at parking stuff. I've changed positions in a game from one yeah. side to yeah, the yeah, other. Yeah, I was comfortable, it. right? Yeah. yeah. Um, we had a bit of a leash meeting about it. Uh, with Coops was involved and he said yeah, you know, what was he saying oh, he just sort of said listen I'm, I'm going to try um, I'm a 10% chance of playing train without me uh, but in my point of view the best way to play this game is for me to play halfback and defend there yep. do the double bluff and go from there and they sort of were all looking at me going oh what do you think and I went mate oh, yeah. I'm doing it like, yeah, 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 yeah. give it to me I'll, I'll do what I can with it you know? so I'll, did Cooper even have a training session that nah. week or not so we just train like, yeah. as normal. The plan that we're going to do, go to half eight, whatever it was, mate. We had training at Allianz Stadium. Yep. We had helicopters flying over Channel 9 helicopters, trying to work out where we were standing in position. I remember that, yeah. Where we were going to do. 100%. So we had to, yeah. when the helicopter was there, we had to go to our normal position. Yeah, like, yeah. That is all time. Do a little bit of changing around. Yeah. Um, anyway, the week goes on. Then captain's run. Yep. Coops comes in. Yep. But Bob... Before that, sorry, I'm asking Coops every day how he's yeah, going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> how you going there, mate? You good? Yeah, yeah good, yeah, good. Yeah, okay, yeah. Right? Oh, yeah. getting a bit of a say, oh, yeah, feeling yeah. okay. I was like, oh, good, mate. Well, you let me know if you need anything, all right? I'm yeah. here to help you out, like, whatever it took. Yeah. Anyway, came in, Captain John, and goes, boys, I'm, um, I'm going to do it. I'm going to play. Yeah. Uh, I don't know how much help I'm going to be, but I'm going to yeah. bite down on my mouth guard. I'm going to have a crack for you. Yeah. And, mate, you should have seen me. There was a video. Mm. I just fell back into my chair and went, oh, thank God. Yeah. Thank God. I went back to my right row position, right yeah. back row position. But did, did anyone know how big the break was? Or was that, yeah, was that kept we all knew. No, we all so, knew. So, you know, even from, um, you know, from a coaching point of view, it's a big call, isn't it? Because that, things could have went pear-shaped. Mate, you, for you sure. You could get a knock on that and he's off first game. You're down, you're down one person. Yeah. The, the pain killing injections and the needling, mate, they'll, they'll probably write a book about it one day, like yeah. what, how they had to do it and what yeah. happened and... Um, you know, he did no training all week. He's, he couldn't yep. lift his shoulder above his head and it'd be grinding with the bones yeah. grinding together. Crazy. Like, absolutely, mm. absolutely crazy. So, yeah. 
he's, he's decided to do it. Uh, I just felt an instant, um, like, calm fall mm. over the group. Like, yep. oh, righto. But in, in the meantime with all this, Kiri was there in the background. Yes, and Kiri that's right. was a guy who went, righto, you, you coaches, sort out what you're going to do. But yep. I'm going to grab this team yeah. and grab this game uh, by the neck. Yep. And I'm just not going to let it lock. Yep. It's on me. Like, that's how he felt. Yeah. And I think the rest is sort of history, isn't it? Like, with no. the way he played. Yeah, um, and the match performance. Yeah, and, you know, the feeling I had before that game when, when we are all standing there as a group just about to run on with and Coops was there, like, still couldn't even really warm up. Couldn't, like, do yeah. any tackling you. Amazing. He got his injections right, like, at yep. the two-minute warning bell. Yep. And he said, nah, boys, I'm, I'm going to give you everything I have. Whatever it is, I'm going to lay it on the line for you. And I've yep. just gone... Mate, if this guy's going to go out and do that, I am. I'm We're not losing. Borderline <laughs> going to die on this field today yeah, if you're yeah. going to do that. Like, yeah. Because you're defending the side. That's him, right. Yeah. yeah. There's no way I was yeah. going to let him let him get yeah. at him. I was just going to do whatever I could to you did a bloody to good help job him. Too, yeah. yeah. Well, but mate, the way we started that game, like it was. Yeah. You, you guys are in control. We just went for it. Yeah. And yeah. we we knew we had to go. Like, and it felt like it was a bit of a dream. Like having the game sort of wrapped up with. With like five or ten minutes to go, yep. is one of the some of my best memories of like footy. Like oh, I was all time. It was yeah. oh, you could just enjoy it. Like every and, run, you know, every tackle. Melbourne too is always nice. Like one and of the guys would get tackled, and you'd be telling him to get up, play the ball. And like man, we're, we're gonna do this. Yeah, like yeah, it's yeah, just yeah. every yeah. little break in the game. It was yeah. oh, couldn't get too excited, but you could feel it was coming. So that's um, unbelievable. And then obviously, you know, you win the game, the celebrations again. You get the yeah, feel, yeah. that feeling. All that great yeah. stuff. So then, anyway, come back to training again in, in 19, and I felt like a yep. group of us learnt a big lesson from 13 to 14, yes, right? Yeah, about yeah. how Let's to go after that. it. It doesn't doesn't just automatically happen going back and yeah. playing well and performing. No, no, again. you need to go back to all it's, these little standards again. You need to rebuild the house, right? Yep. So 19 was such a big year for us. Just, um, yeah, I felt like there was a good core of us mm. that. Like, you know, I don't, I don't think Coops had done it, gone back to back. It hadn't been done since, or he hadn't, hadn't been done since the Broncos. Yes, 1993. Yeah, yep. so yep. there was a real, like, nah, let's let's go after this. We've all sort of tasted premiership success, but mm. let's go and do history. Let's go, people say it can't be done, so let's go chase it. Like, And you need a lot of luck. You need injuries and things to go yeah. your way. And, but um, yeah, yeah, that's right. But towards the end of the year, there was no little dip. You guys nah. just, you and just it, we grew. I think yeah. as the year went again, yeah. we went as the semis and that rolled around. There was an air of confidence of, righto, we can, we can do this. We played mm. South again. We played Melbourne in the prelim, mm. and then we'll come up that's against right. a, a Canberra I, team. Which I, I was, thought on the day you guys were going to pump them. I thought grand final day. Yeah, the atmosphere around the precinct was unbelievable yeah. and I thought mate you guys are going to pump them but to Canberra's credit they came the play they did they, mate. It, it, it was a bloody physical it was a ding and had, it, like, at a period in the midway through the second half I remember you know we're sitting there and uh, I was in Nick Plaza's box actually and, and the tension he was yeah. just like that biting his nails yeah it, and, was, uh, mate, it was unbelievable it was a crazy I'll yeah. just go like even the day of the game we were in the ho- we stayed at a hotel over the Novotel just in Olympic Park yep and uh, you just, we, which we normally do. And you, this day though, trying to have a little afternoon kip. Yeah. And all I could hear was these Raiders drums. Oh, you mate. know, the Raiders clap. Like yeah. Every, for three it hours. It was on outside, yeah. Oh, <laughs> mate, I couldn't wait to get out of bed, have a shower and just get to the game. I just wanted to get away from the clap. Like yeah, it was, yeah, yeah. They were, they took it to a new level, you know. And that yeah. was, mate, that was such a special time for us. Like a crew that just put in, you know. A good it's, two uh, years of such hard work, yeah. and coming back into the change room, what was yeah. the feeling going back to back? Oh, just like winning it again. It yeah. didn't wasn't last year yeah. mattered, but it, it was you got to yeah, do something yeah, special yeah. with the crew, and um, yeah, not many people even experienced one of those. In, that's in right. Two years yeah, in a row, yeah. you, you've lifted the trophy, mate. But it's we just enjoyed it together. I think, as you said before, in thirteen, after every time we won it, we go on the field after the game. Yeah, did you do the same? Yeah. Just us. Yeah. Has just that. the crew. This crew will never be together again. Yep. Like, and and you just spend time, you know, enjoying it with each other. And mm. then you go back to the Leeds club. There's thousands of people, all just that happy for us, and and we're happy for them because they did it too. And mate, it's it's just such a good night for for everybody involved. And it's addictive. You want to go. You want to go mm. again. You want to do it again. You want to go again. So.